The fire began early Saturday morning when an arsonist started a fire in the Daystar studio. Daystar was in the midst of a major renovation and upgrade of its studio here in Jerusalem overlooking Mount Zion and the Temple Mount. The fire destroyed the new work and much of the existing facility. The control room is, uh, I'd say, probably totally devastated. Dave Charette, the general contractor overseeing the renovations, showed us the destruction. This is where we filmed from. There were four cameras that would be, uh -huh. be back in this area here. And Marcus and Joni would be, or their interviewee would be sitting here. Uh -huh. And then you have this fabulous view behind them. Yeah. These before and after shots reveal the extent of the devastation. We're here in the new Daystar TV studios in Jerusalem, Israel. Marcus and Joni Lamb dedicated the Daystar Jerusalem studio in March of 2011. Daystar is one of the largest Christian television networks in the world that reaches more than 200 countries and nearly 700 million people with its programs. Even in the midst of the destruction, Charette believes God is at work. I believe that God has a, a reason and a purpose, and at the very least, he'll redeem what has happened here. So these ashes will raise up be raised up and uh, proclaim the glory of God. Daystar pledges to continue their Jerusalem operations and asks for prayer for continued protection. Chris Mitchell, CBN News, Jerusalem.